Peggy Piper. Hi, Phil. Good to see you. Good to be here. Good to see you, babe. Thank you. Hey, what's the process for getting an agent? The process for getting an agent? It's a good question. Um, I'll, I'll, it's probably a twofold answer. The process for getting an agent or a manager or some sort of representation, there's a couple different ways to kind of go about it. You see me, babe? Someone that books you gigs, that either say you're, you're a model, you meet with them, they'll help you to get headshots, good prep to put, put your portfolio together, and then they'll go out and try to get you work. They'll go out and try to, you know, submit you for commercials or put you out on auditions for a movie role or whatever it is that you're, you know, you're, that you want your expertise to be. An agent will do that and they take a fee for that, anywhere between 10 to 20 percent. Uh, a manager is someone that's with you the full ride. So a manager would, could be the one that could find you the agent, or a manager could be the one that will find you or get you the record deal. Manager's more of a personal day-to-day -day experience. I have a manager, he was at the concert last night, Brandon Creed, and I have an agent, which is William Morris Agency. And so they're a, they're a very large company, and they have different <coughs> Uh, representatives that will meet us, you know, different cities and have different different means of um, bringing into income to us. There'll be one for touring. There'll be someone for television. There'll be someone for live events. So I'll always see different people. 